Aloha, it's Hermes. Welcome back for another video. Today's video, we're going to be talking about limited edition trader van weapons. So yeah, make sure to watch this video until the very end and subscribe to the post notification bell icon on so you never miss out on my amazing videos. I have more amazing content coming your way, so make sure you are subscribed to this channel and to like this video, comment down below as well. Really would make my day if you guys could go ahead and do that. Thank you so much to IG Acura for being a member of the YouTube channel. Please make sure to purchase a membership. Link is in the description, so if you guys would like to go ahead uh and buy one that would mean the world to me if you guys could and thank you so much for uh, chris for commenting something unique in the comment section down below if you guys want your comment featured in my next video all you guys have to do is be subscribed to the channel with the post notification bell icon on and in order to finish off this video i will be using hello's loadout so if you guys got a loadout comment your loadout in the comment section down below and make sure to follow me on instagram hermes pg3d super easy and simple i'll be following back one of you guys every week every sunday so yeah and please make sure to join my discord server link is in the description and with all the announcements out of the way let's dive right into the video all right so as you know i chose six weapons that don't usually come back often at all so ultimatum hasn't been back in the trader van for a while as goes for rebel you know it comes for certain events and all of that as well assassin dagger has not been in a van um it's been in like you can buy in like deals and stuff i believe but you know it doesn't come really in a van as goes for the cooking totem not really in a van it comes for certain events and all and the elephant hunter has not been back in a van for a very very long amount of time as goes for the dark mage wand it's been back but you know it doesn't come back like that it comes back in like a lottery or something so i chose these six weapons let me know in the comment section down below if you guys want me to do any sort of like trader van videos the devs do watch my videos so like maybe you know you could comment a really cool video idea and i can might you know maybe do a video on it we don't know we'll actually have to see but yeah um anyways i just chose these weapons because i felt like they need you know maybe more attention maybe they could come back you know maybe for my old account i don't know maybe anyways i'll be having gameplay with this well all of these weapons all six of them as well i'll be using every single one of them in this video so yeah stay tuned for the gameplay so as you know cooking totems pretty good assassin dagger is pretty good for melee zones i actually use assassin daggers for melee zones on my alt account due to the fact i do not have cashbacks on my alt account so i definitely would recommend if assassin daggers ever come back in a van which they 100 percent will but a lot of weapons do come back in a van once they've already been in a van i'm just waiting for heart of volcano that's why you guys saw heart of volcano i've always wanted heart of volcano low key i know some of you guys in my comment section um i believe someone commented to this they were they would give me their heart of volcano because they don't even use it at all that would literally I love you so much, but, you know, I can't... That's not even possible, so... Yeah, but I wish I did have Heart of Volcano. I did miss out on a chance. Uh, it was in a van, and I was like, oh my gosh, should I get it or not? And I did not get it. I'm really, really angry with myself because, you know, I didn't think about... I don't think I had enough coupons at the time due to the fact I just... I did not have enough at all. And, you know, I kind of regret not getting Heart of Volcano now because I really want it, and I don't have it. So, it kind of sucks for me. Anyways... Dark Mage Wand, you know, it's a pretty good heavy as well. Definitely would recommend making this, you know, maybe mythical if you use it a lot. But, you know, a lot of people who do make Dark Mage Wand uh, mythical, they're usually, like, they're pretty good with, like, rocket jumping and all that sort of stuff. Or they like using Dark Mage Wand for, like, tricks or three-cat spamming. I don't really like to use Dark Mage Wand often, but if you want to use this weapon, it's pretty good with max modules, I would say. It's, like, a guaranteed one to two shot kill. So that's pretty awesome, I would say so myself. And, uh, yeah, we got Ultimatum here. You know, pretty good primary. Nothing uh, else left to say about that. We got Rebel. Pretty amazing for backup zones. Definitely recommend using Rebel for a backup zone, of course. And then we got Cooking Totem. Boom, just killed this bot. Let's do this. Let's go. But, yeah, um, low-key, just Elephant Hunter does feel kind of weird. So, if you do have Elephant Hunter, doesn't it feel like it's kind of loose? The sniper feels loose when you use it. And if you don't have Elephant Hunter, it's kind of like using the default sniper rifle in a way. The sniper doesn't have much of a security if you put it into terms like that. Like, let's just say it just feels really weird. And from, like, the way I'm just shooting, it just... You need to have some what of, like, decent aim act to actually aim the weapon. I mean, it's not that bad for three-cat spamming. It's pretty good for, like, clips if you're trying to aim and use that weapon. But if I were just using it in a public game, I definitely wouldn't use it. It doesn't do a lot of damage. And if you have high mods, you got Pumpkin Mask as well. It'll do more damage than, you know, in reality if you don't have it like high mods or pumpkin mask but i would just say you know it's pretty good just it's good for looks and looking good in your uh, armory that's all i gotta say looking good in your gallery all right it's just it's just for looks guys at the end of the day but yeah we got rebel i would say i would definitely use rebel you know just in 
you know close situation due to the fact it does have some pretty good area damage i would say so myself but let me know in the comment section down below if you thought these weapons are pretty limited like i thought they were all limited you know but in order to finish off this video i'll be using hello's loadout so if you guys have a loadout make sure to comment your loadout in the comment section down below as well let me know if you guys enjoyed this video or not i don't know like low-key i had such a fun time making this video i saw a pixel gun for about 30 minutes thought about what i'm gonna do for the video what weapons i'm gonna use and i was like i'm definitely gonna have to use these six weapons i was just like yeah i have to there's like no way i'm not gonna use them you know but you know make sure to like this video comment down below as well just really make sure to like follow me on instagram join my discord server and to subscribe to the post notification bell icon on so you never miss out on my amazing videos stay up to date with my content that i'm posting you know and i hope you guys did enjoy and i will see y'all later thank you guys so much for watching